Good evening. Hmm. Alrighty, folks. Details of the hemp stock in Portland. It's at Kelly Point Park. The 10th and 11th this weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Um, I get the dubious pleasure of hanging out with Rockin' TW and his crew, Yahoo. He's a, he is a camera hog. So if you you see us walking around, don't want to, don't want to get your picture taken, jump in a ditch, okay? Because he takes pictures of everybody. Um, anyhow, so if you want to come hang out with me, I will be hanging with Sarah probably Thursday, Miss um, Frank. Yes, I will tag you in this video. I uh, can't wait to hook up with you. I might get some merchandise from you. I will do an inventory on what I've got and get back and get you get a list of, of what I need. Um, anyhow, um, if you're going to be there, hit my Facebook page. Let me know so we can hook up. We'll exchange numbers or do whatever so we can hook up there. If you're going to be there, like Doc, if you're going to be there, please let's hook up again. Hempfest was fucking fun as hell. <laughs> I had a blast walking around with you. You're a very interesting person, and I am interested in your sign-making abilities, so I want to hook up with you on that, too. So, anyhow, uh, Hempstock, Portland, Oregon, Kelly Point Park. Be there. It's important. It's about the hemp industry, which we really need. We really need to get that going because the economy sucks. Duh. Hello, where you been? Under a rock? That was on the newspaper this morning that I read. I, I couldn't believe it. How can you be that stupid? But... Anyhow, hemp could reverse all that. We could start building factories here and not, you know, like in Bangladesh and Taiwan and all those other third world countries that we're putting stuff in. And don't forget about China. <laughs> China's building factories in Mexico. So anyhow, uh, remember, trust nobody and be at Hempstock because I'm going to be there with Rock and TW and crew. Bye.